Hello guys, we are back. We're in some more arena. We have recovered from our crash before. Uh, I think it might have been related to the this tracker thing. Um, not really sure though. We'll give it a another go. If it happens again, we might stop using it for now. Uh, we got a pack though, so that's cool. Let's see what uh what we get. Spit flame. Yeah. All right. That's a card. Um. Alright, so let's hop back into a, another game. I think we're going to switch back to the Esper deck this time around. Definitely my preferred deck of the three, but I'm kind of a, a control player, if you guys haven't figured that out by now. Not so much a control player as much as like a tempo player. I guess by that logic, I might like the just blue black deck better because it gets to put on more pressure whereas this deck like the one problem i have with it is i don't really get to put on pressure but we'll see how it plays out i mean we do have i guess we really just have to fairy fairy scarab god and the liliana are sort of our pressure cards sand is keepable it's good versus aggressive decks against control decks, so well, we got all the time in the world, so nothing to be worried about. This looks like we're playing against the uh, black red aggro. Oh, nope, just kidding, we're playing against Grixis. So it's probably going to be Grixis control. So we are just going to tap land and fatal push. So Grixis control. Uh, these expertise is probably a little bit worse. Um, I guess Bolas is the top end we're worrying about. There's the uh, creature Bolas. I think he's a four drop. Um, so we'll have to contempt that, which is fine. Cast down will not hit it, so I should probably keep that in mind. Put an effort to. There it is. Each opponent discards a card. See you. Catacomb and Contempt. I do like that card a lot. I definitely want to put a Grixis deck together. I guess that's maybe that's the next deck I can do. Because I have like a, uh, you know, the big Bolas. Hmm. Do not have an answer for that one. Hate to see it. Let's just dig. Uh, Doomfall. I already made my land drop, though. So he gets to bring Bolas back. And then I Doomfall, and he probably just gets rid of the Bolas, I guess. I don't know if he can flip it, since it's a uh, token. But yeah, for this deck, I really just need the... Uh, Whatchamacallits. The the bow losses. I guess I need the mana base too. Dragon Skull Summits in particular. Um hmm. I mean we have to cast down. If he has a counter for this, then I think we can just scoop. We're not coming back. But alternatively he just brings Bolas back and sacks that instead. Let him decide. Yeah. Okay. I'll siphon her. Uh, that's not good. Actually, I can kill that. And now he has to get rid of the Scarab God. Since I don't think he chose it as a Doomfall target yet. Yeah. Alright, that worked out, I think. So now he can't bring Bolas back either. I worked out very well. Still, we have no action in hand, so we definitely need to draw some cards. Another Scarab God. Concealed Courtyard. I think that's probably game. I don't know, the boss is exiled. What am I talking about? I've been talking about it this whole time, but... It's no longer an issue. 
Nothing in my graveyard either, so he's really just swinging for five here. So, that gives us four turns at the moment. So what our Grixis deck look like? We play... That's good, I guess. I mean, I guess I could cast it. If he has a counter spell, though. Then bummer. But... He's a creature again. He didn't have the counter spell last time. He's drawn... One card or two? Might have drawn two. He played the Scarab God and then he attacked. Yeah, Sleager 2. Commit. That's probably just game then. I'm not drawing it next turn. I mean, I guess I'll have one extra turn. If he, you know, draws nothing. Probably unlikely though. Or I just have a Vraska's constant. Vraska's Contempt on top right now. That would work as well. Liliana. So that protects him from the Doomfall, and it also gives us lethal. Contempt means we can live. Yeah, I mean... I have to do it to live, so. I could do Liliana, but. Doesn't really matter. I could kill this dude too, but I might as well hold it. So I can get two for one with some more, uh. More zombie tokens next turn. Yeah, we're too behind on cards. Anything else? Another Scarab God. Number three. There's Doomfall. I mean... That works. I'm gonna throw this all first just to make sure the tokens go away, because I don't really know how it stacks up. Get rid of another Scarab God. Her ultimate doesn't do anything. So... Yeah, she could reanimate this guy, though. We don't really need to discard, but we need to draw more removal. And we're still just four cards behind. Well, plus the board. Can he flip it right now? No, he needs one more land. Does he have it in hand? Would appear not. Okay. Cast out. So I have to hit this again. Let him keep Eliana. Gonna dig for a counter. See if he finds one. Guess we live a little bit longer. But now our opponent's five cards up. We got a few turns as it stands. Our opponent apparently doesn't have a counter. It's a third Bolas. He's got three Bolases and three Scarab Gods we've seen. We haven't drawn any of our threats either. Nope. Alright, let's game. Pop over to the sideboard. So what do we want? I think we drop the cast downs. They don't kill anything. That fatal push doesn't already kill. Do we want the Reborn? Do we want the Negates? I 
They don't deal with uh, Bolas. They only deal with Liliana and the counter magic. Um, hmm. Could drop the expertises for the negates. But maybe I just want the siphoners instead. I just don't know how valuable these negates are. Alternatively, the duresses, but I mean, how many non creatures did we even see? It's really just a Liliana. Oh, I need one more card. Alright, I'll throw a duress in. We'll see, we'll see. We can win this matchup, but we need to be able to put on some pressure. This hand is bad. We have to fetch a swamp, and then our glacial fortress will come in tapped, and then doomfall turn three. That's our game plan. But I mean, double doomfall and double Vraska's contempt is very good cards against this deck. So we'll have to go for it. All right, so you just fetch now. I'm lazy. Oh my god, I don't play basic swamp. That's probably a bit bad. Well, island it is. And that means we get we got one black mana at the moment. So hopefully we draw black. <laughs> Another doom fall. I mean, I guess there's worse draws. But yeah, that's a lot of black mana symbols. Not a lot of black mana. So I got the four fetid pools, the four drowned catacombs. The drowned catacombs are all that come in untapped though. Uh, I think I just pass. Until he drops Liliana on turn five, I don't really need to worry about doom falling. And I could just counter his creature. So I can save myself the black mana until I absolutely need it. So that's, I think, my game plan at the moment. What you got? Spring wheel, sure. So this isolated chapel and the four drowned catacombs are untapped black sources. Or I guess another ether hub. Alright, I'll counter the bolas. So now we doom fall. And hope he has nothing. Ooh. Let's make sure we click the right one. Gear Hall, Contempt, and Bolas. So we take Bolas. And that gives us a turn. We really need now. We need two swamps to be able to play these contempts. What is he discarding? Probably the two ether hubs, right? Yeah. All right. We need some good draws. Do you have a siphoner to play? Guess not. Negate. It's not the worst draw. But yeah, we don't have black mana, so this is pretty over, I think. You can counter Liliana, but that's about it. Unlucky. Another champion. I'd rather not team fall these. I'm 
pretty much needs to run like two drowned catacombs in a row at this point. Um, siphon or two. Look for a swamp. Help. We got one. So what do we do? We Doomfall. Take the Gear Hulk and call it a day. It's gonna take six here. Opponent draws two. Search. So let's play the search. See if he counters. He didn't, but I think he has a counter. Yep. So we're pretty dead. We don't have a board wipe. If we draw black mana, then we can stay alive. Probably for a couple turns, but we gotta draw a black mana. Letting us keep the search is nice. It might help us help us get there. What you got? Cycling, I can deal with. So if he has like double negate, then I just die. Does that kill me? No, because I gain two life. Fetid pools is tapped. I need an untapped sorcerer, I'm dead. Um, that does not keep me alive. So, one, two, three, four. What could I get? One, two, three. So, I need three. I have three mana left. I can't find another black, so I think I'm just dead. One, two, three. Take a look, but. Yeah, it doesn't do it. Alright, we're dead. Man, that was a rough one. I think we win that game hard if I had to... Well, I don't even know about that actually, because we we never drew anything to put on pressure either. Like, best case scenario, we would have exiled two different, two more things and maybe negated something. So like, we're still not in winning shape there. We just didn't draw any of our threats in either of those games. Alright, well, we'll wrap that one up here, though. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe if you enjoy the video, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.